Yeah, blessed day guys. Welcome back to the bus, the Pani Beach. Uh, I walk in at the sun and I go on. What a little vibes, you see me? You don't know. Big up Jamaicans everywhere on the day. Big up Canada driver, then big up US, London, everybody who watch this video and tune in. But anyway, back to serious business now. Guys. I keep a show last night and I'm going to preview one video. I'm not going to hear from the lady. Why? I don't know. These stories just keep to get more interested. I'm going to ask you one question in the comments, ladies. Me while you're not listening to What's the youngest you would you date? What's the youngest man you would have date? I'm not a man because a man love young woman. So I ask a woman them. A woman was 65. Would you date a guy who was 30, 35? Zane? I want you to put in your comment. I don't have to put in your age. Put the youngest one who would date. If you want to put 20 to 60 or whatever. This lady came to Jamaica, was staying at a hotel. See? And she met this man. This man in her 40s. I can't tell me a year. See? She meet him in a COVID time. So he knows the things slow. She starts saying money take care of him. The whole nine yard. Then he decides he want to marry her. But after she married him, I know he hear a similar story like this. But when I listen to the one, the one I'm more interested. All right. When I know bash her, she beg me change her advice because she never want to come out and I force her to come. So through that, make me walk. Make me listen. I'm um, like up the video, guys. Make a listen. Yes, Mix Up Boss. Thank you for having a program. I'm just here to share my story so it can shed a light on a lot of these stuff that's happening in relationship, especially with us women over in the United States and what guys sees us as. Gone are the days when guys sees us as a mother figure. Yeah, a wife. And I have the Oswald. Gone are the days, I write. I know a lot of people might bash me, call me names, and say me I eat that, but I don't care. May I share this story? Because I want awareness so ladies can be smart and be um, be on the lookout and look out for red flags. Sometimes it's the red flags I ignore it because we are afraid of being single, especially when we reach up in our age. And I already talk about this mix up as, and trust me. What the heck? I have some stuff I would shake your hand. Man, so it is a young boy, I know them, eh? Um, know them, eh? Story from how we know the right things to say and say what. Anyway, let me get to know my story. So, it would be blamed by a show can bash me and say whatever they want to say. All right, I flew down to Jamaica, 2019. Yeah, me and my sister, we stayed at the guest house in Ochi Reyes. While I was in Ochi Reyes at the hotel, I saw this nice mm, nice man and he asked me if i'm here by by myself i said yes now talk to you and i try to remember exactly so if you may um now i talk like if you hear me repeat about some things i may have to try and remember memorize it yeah um yeah so while i was there i was at the bar yeah and i saw him and he asked me what's up what am i here uh, where am I from? Uh, we have a conversation and then I told him that I was there with my sister. And does it to of us. I asked him when he's there. He said it was there with his daughter. So I said, all right, we exchange number. Yeah. But when we exchange number now, when we exchange a number, I realized that his, his number is a Jamaican number. So I'm also foreign as there, not saying Jamaica, they might come in now and then, but most of foreigners, I was surprised. Anyway, maybe he's a Jamaican and he is living overseas and he using a different SIM card. All right, to my understanding now, after that, may I name me top back? I, I, I did spend like four days out there before I went to my family house. So his day was the last day when I met up with him and we drink our talk and we hug. And he says that he's single and he, he's looking forward to being my life. 
All right. I lost my husband about 10 years ago. So at the time I met him, I was 60. I think I was about 67. Yeah, I think I was about 67. Yeah, I heard I mentioning a show like 65 or something, but I think I, I'm 67 at the time when it happened. Um, boss. All right, so let me get back to you, but it doesn't matter. Not about the age and whatever. What happened now? Mix up, boss. Um, yeah. This video that you are posting, please. Met my voice. The animals, please. Don't want anybody to recognize my voice. I keep this from a lot of people. But I'm going to share it in your platform. People might have an idea as well, but they're not going to really know as long as you hide my real vice. Come here, I hide a lot of people vice, so, you know. So, anyway, we talk on Nintendo that he's living in Jamaica. And, you know, he can't find a good man. But trust me, he was very good looking. He was attractive. And he was in his 40s. So I know a lot of you ladies are going to bash me say, oh, me take up young boy. Let me tell you this. My husband who passed away, he was a cheater, but I stuck with him. You know, I stuck with him because of the kids. That's why I stuck with him. That is why I stuck with him. So I don't want anybody to come at me and say, oh, you should I take a big man. Big man cheat, young guys cheat. My situation is not about cheating. It's about uh, opportunities. All right. So no. I went back to the state and then prior to that, um, COVID come on, you know, he said he's a contractor. He do me to work and do a main yard. All right. So COVID comes. So I said to myself, I said, since many my talk, we spoke on the fortnight, the end, we talk about what I'm going to do when I'm come to Jamaica and all of that. All right. So. He told me that he want to marry me. So bear in mind, mix up us. My husband did and gone. We did by myself. Bit did and gone. So I'm sorry right then. But I think about it. And you know what I did? I'm a child of God. I let me put it out there. I prayed about it. Yes, I prayed about it. And I'm a true believer and I'm a true Christian. Jane, I'm going to get back to that part of the story. While he was in Jamaica, you know, COVID, nobody not working, not getting a bill in for bill. So instead, ask me for money to buy food. So, you know, everybody was laying in the lockdown. So I used to send him money so he could buy food, sort out himself and all of that. And while the COVID was like, it a get out uh, it, it we have a, a cool long he started to tell me that he'd like a, a van so he can carry his tools and do business um but he said if not now one can tear it off you ask him for money i don't have any problem sending him any money on her because i have my plan and as then so anyway a couple months run off so we got married in 20 we call it we married about January. I think it was twenty twenty one. Yeah, twenty twenty one. We got married. And yeah, we got married. So I'm at my speed at the birds that we got married. Put in paperwork. And the whole nine yard. My family did my tell me say, Why may I come down come married somebody younger than me? I told him that age is just a number. And I did pray about it. So let me put it at the come back to the break. I prayed about it and whatever God lead me to believe I'm going to do it. All right. Start putting the paperwork on the filing. All right. So speed up the process now. You know, COVID. So while well, a lot of stuff get delayed, everybody can relate to that time of it was everything I go backward in that in them COVID times. So everything depend back truck and backlog and even visa application with, you know, so I did have to just wait it out. But anyway, luckily, he got it in 2024, which is this year, right? So he came over. But listen now, oh, everything broke out. 
when he when he was under filing, him skip the two year. I know normally I forget the two year first before you get the ten year. So through the COVID and the bot like when him come through now I'll already do the two year as in like the marriage was um it passed the two year. So when him come and get a ten year instead of the two year. So you see oh boy lucky, you can get ten year green card in America. Alright. You know what I say? After after such man come America and start hearing say Oh you wanna go up on your own and you wanna go look wanna go look for your friend among get one job kind tired in tired uh which part me down you know, in board I said, okay, well, we can move, we can relocate to somewhere where you can, you know, I would just rent my, uh, rent my house and we can rent somewhere and to make him happy. He said, no, you know, most still went because of them carnawa, me, got him certain things. You know, I said that guy leave my house. One Sunday morning, say I'm going to new cousin, and he's going to be back late on weekends. What they look like? Are something we planned from Jamaica mix up as? I mean, I tell you, when that guy leave and go to that next state, I'm not going to call this state. I hardly hear from him. The first week, in say I do over time, so he never come. Till one week, reads two week, till three week. And I saw no one then me drop a one call. But after that, everything gone. Change him number. And him, I mean, I know where I'm there. Zane, so, what well, happened now? I stop it. So, him thinks I get a 10 year. But I get a annulment. So that he cannot get his ten years, yeah. You tell me get people and tell about an all man. And a come on. So it, that's is like I the is like the marriage never happen. So I stop it. So he think that he got it and gone. So let's see how that work out. Yeah, so I don't want to say much about it, but yeah. So uh, that up uh, mix up us. Yeah, so something by your sure. Sometimes we see the red flag and we ignore it. When we hear you start talking, you say, why are you daddy America? And send for your man Jamaica when I come up come put nothing on the table. What was I thinking? Secondly, I hear you say, more time we pray to God. And sometimes the mind control we, how we things are God. Yeah, sometimes we things are God are sure with science. Because I pray for this man, I'm a child of God. And while I tell you, Ladies and here is going to bash me and say, why a quick figure married man? All right. My philosophy is, if I'm going to be with someone and I'm in my church, I have to know the person, then I got married. Yeah, that is my philosophy. Get to know the person, then we get married. I'm not the type of lady who's going to run and go into bedroom and make a man of him wear with me now. I'm a Christian and I'm going to remain a Christian. So, when all that you guys might say, Ray, I mean, we might say, we should God me pray to, but we tell it is sometime we want something. I would tell you, say, yeah. God say, I, 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 the person, they're right. I will be forced and go take that person. Then, it come like across it to take in your life. But sometimes, God, you see the red flags and see I go in a danger and make you go in I just forget a wake up call and you can't steer back yourself. That was a horrible experience. When he come to America and he was there, he only wanted to have sex with me. You know, sometimes when I'm in the bedroom, he will outside watching TV saying they're ready to come to the bed. I mean, yes, I know I'm in my 60s. I may not look like a 20 or a 30 year old woman, but I still have my thing upset where I can't do my thing said where. 
But what I want to say, why waste that woman time and don't tell her from dear one that they don't want her? If that man did come to me straight and tell me, say, he might look a local boss who come America and if me can't help him and wait it, maybe I would think about it. But to have me believe in that we are in love, I'd want like this for you. And for no say, this is how you come and cheat me. It is not nice. It is not nice. But mix up, boss. Me learn from a mistake. <laughs> and I hope I let a woman learn. Man get used, or man get used. Got a lot of guys on your channel mirror say, then come at Jamaica and find. And people might think that we can't get a man in America or England or Canada. We can, but we want to stick to our culture. And sometimes the guys are over there where we all see and what we want. So sometimes we will come back to Jamaica and we see a child man who tells us that yeah, we could try with him. Because at least we're a child with one of our own. But trust me, right now, I'm going to remain single. I'm going to be by myself. And oh, I almost devoted this part. That guy... Met my pressure, gone over 200. I did end up in the hospital. And trust me, if it wasn't for my family and church brother and church sister, I wouldn't be here. Prayers care me true, mix up us. Prayers care me true. And fit. When all other people might say, them to believe in our God, but there is a God. I'll win that man feel me. I still never give up hope. Can you know what I said to myself? Maybe. I prayed about it. And the signs that I saw, I tell myself that it, it was God. But sometimes when it too desperate and anxious for something, did I like to see I owes a sell? Zin and the owes value, 20 million, somebody said in my sale for five. And you run the jar the money and get the money. I run for go buy it and when I buy it to find out that is a scam. The five toes are gone. So that's how life is. You take chance, you gamble with it. And sometime you win, you win some, and sometime you lose some. So all the ladies them out there. Zane, wanna all like me. Wanna know if you have a man for happy. And I can't just stay still. Not know out there we will miss. My nose no for we. Don't want to be alone and that away. That I go be with downfall. I'm at me telling her this. Man in a Jamaica, use a man. Man in America, use a man. None of them. And a day, and a, and, and a different from the other. Then I said, God, when we work, I'm below ourselves. These guys, they tend to say, yeah, they want somebody where achieve a lot. And sometimes, not for them, that not for being to the table. Not for these guys, things that, yeah. Bedroom pleasure that all one supposed to can keep us um um submissive to them. No. There's a lot of things who come in our relationship we work together. So I say work. So I say go. Anyway, mix up bars, big up yourself. Let a my look at two cent. And well she heard my platform. Yeah man, I remember for I had my advice, please and thanks. Cool. And you see the discussion here, guys, on a serious level, I'm going to tell you this. A whole heap of people in America, I don't know about England and Canada, face this. You know how much woman, I have a woman for my show last night, and she said she had seek somebody. The woman said, I said, you talk to a nice gentleman from Jamaica. She said, nobody where she have a card. Nobody. You understand? Married somebody and carry them up now. And give them green card is a gamble, man. I don't know how I could have pretend with somebody say I love them. And then when I reach, I run half. I can't do it. I cannot do it. I don't know. Yo. I don't know how people do it, brother. But I can't do it. And I tell you already, ladies. When you don't reach certain age, you don't take certain risks in life. You don't can't manage it. You hear what a lady say? Our pressure gone up. And if I never feel a church, brother, them and people. Eh? I know the father and say, oh, a young boy, she gonna take up, she gonna take up young boy for 
I that for reach her. No, you know, can't look on life. So everybody choose who they want to choose. And as I say in my first part of the video, why are the youngest? I don't believe a 67, 65 year old woman, if you talk to a man in her 40s, or 50s, what do you think? Age is just a number. Big man a chick woman, young boy a chick woman. So I see him. See him go see him and them. I hold up a man call me. When you hear the stories them, all you want to bring up the one in Canada. She and the daughter. When you hear them, when you hear the lady say, she bring up a Rasta man in Canada. And the man in, 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 in daughter, this are. It always happen. People just want to go and get them stay and use people. Me not use nobody for go to foreign. So I go ever they are Jamaica. And that's my thing there. Kind of nice. And I feel, say, you hear a lady say, she stop it. I think me and people say, put it in our comments, guys. I think if you give people them card, when the people get green card or tenure, you can um, stop it before it got you or it go. I don't know the legal way. Put it in our comment. But uh, that she say, it's a bit so it's going to be interested to hear what really go on in the story. There. But anyway, guys, we're going to chat about this later. Me gone, big up on yourself. My number is 876-277-3254. Reach me upon that. All right, no other number. All right, link me within the story. And make we end up and shout out. Glory, my gone.